Yo, what's going on, YouTube? In today's video, guys, I'm going to be going over every single one-shot sniper in Warzone 3. The original plan was I was going to do a video on each one, but so many of y'all have been asking about this one and that one, so I decided to throw it all into one video. So, hey, if you guys have been enjoying Warzone 3, make sure to go down below, drop a big booty like and comment. And if you're new here, man, make sure to smash that subscribe button. We upload bangers every other day. But all right, guys, enough of me talking. Let's get right into the video. Gone. Enemy destroyed. Use your attack map to hunt down the rest of them. So the first sniper that we're going to be going over is the Cat AMR. As of right now, according to Call of Duty, this is the only quote unquote one shot sniper in Warzone 3. And I'm saying that because you don't have to run an ammunition type. But even that is kind of up in question, but we'll go over that later. Now, I know what everybody thinks about this sniper, that it's slow, it's clunky, it's heavy, the mobility is bad. But I promise you guys, after you see the class setup that I'm running and the gameplay with it, you're going to change your mind. Enemy surveillance is active. Stay low or use the water for Mark. I was just like, I didn't know what you were doing. Yeah, I didn't know what you were doing, man. I would have. Marking the rest of that squad on you. You like that, Mel? I shot him. Oh, you saw that? Squad mates back on station. Good work. Yeah, watch this shot. Whoa. And looked out to my left. Knocked one. No. Where? PA, PA, PA. Watch out for the PA. Knocked what them. the f? Right behind me. Enemies are dropping into the air. Now in those clips, I included a couple of resurgence as well as the big map. And I'm only going to do this for the cat AMR because honestly, I don't think I'll be running a different sniper for Warzone ranked. Or at least when I do play BR. So the first build that we're going to go over is the fastest ADS speed. So starting things off for the laser, we're going to run the FSS OLEV laser or the optic. And again, guys, this is always personal preference. And I know my first video, I was running the SPX 80. But recently, I started running the FTAC Locus SP optic. And honestly, it's really nice. For this stock, we're running the tactical stock pad for the rear grip we're gonna be running the phantom grip and then this is where it's gonna come down to personal preference if you want a faster fire rate for even more aggressive sniping go ahead and run the ephemeral quick bolt but if you're a resurgence demon and you really want that ads speed you're gonna want to run the perdition 24 inch short barrel which is what i was running in the first resurgence clips so this right here is my fast ads build but when it comes to big map we're gonna swap out the perdition 24 inch barrel for this behemoth the zang 34 barrel and just looking at the range and the stats that it gives you i I mean it's pretty impressive not to mention it really does not hurt your ads speed so you're sitting pretty good with this thing so now that we got the cat amr out of the way let's get into my favorite sniper in warzone the victus xmr on me Slides like crazy. Alright, alright, let's get right into my Victus. Now, if you guys have been subscribed to my YouTube channel, I have done so many different videos on the Victus XMR. And although the whole explosive round one shot ammunition type is in question right now, I gotta go with all reliable. So for the laser, we got the VOK laser 7 milliwatt. For the optic, and again, it is personal preference, I got the 6.3 by 14x Karak optic. For the stock, we got the XRK Rise 50. For the rear grip, we got the Bruin Q900 grip. And until we get an update from Call of Duty, we are still running the 50 cal explosive rounds. So now that we got the Victus, 
break this XMR done. Let's move straight into the MCPR 300. Good kill. Yeah, Marking the rest of that squad on your tack map. Get hunting. Oh. Your squad back on station. Oh. Good work. Oh my Please. god. Enemy destroyed. Oh. Your tack map. Watch the sky. You've got reinforcements inbound. Oh, So as you guys can see, this thing is absolutely crazy. By the way, if you guys hear any slamming in the background, that is my baby. And she is going wild. Like I was saying, for all my Rebirth Island players out there, man, if you're going to run a fast ADS sniper that you know will one-shot, this is definitely the one to run. So going right into it for the laser, we got the FSS or the laser. For the optic, we got the HDR scope again. For the bolt, we got the Cronin Smooth Bolt. The ammunition type, like I said, until Call of Duty says otherwise, we're going to run the 300 mag explosive rounds. And then lastly, which I guess a lot of people still don't know about we're gonna run the five round mag and i mean just look at the mobility and the handling man it's green across the board it's actually pretty crazy how insane of a buff the five round mag gives your sniper all right and with that we are now done with the mcpr 300 so the only sniper we have left is the fjx imperium All right, starting it off like we always do. We get the VOK laser 7 milliwatt. For the optic, we are still running this Karak optic. I don't know, man. I really enjoy it. Again, like I always say, man, optics are completely personal preference. For the rear grip, we get the Skull 40. All right, and this is where it gets kind of weird. Me personally, I'm running the four weight explosive rounds. But I've also seen other creators talking about how the high velocity rounds on the FJX do one shot. Now, I have tried this out, and personally, I don't agree. I still think it's the same as Warzone 2, where you still need the explosive rounds to get that one shot knock and all the other fjx imperium builds without the explosive rounds get a damage cap of 299 and then lastly guys and this is probably the best suppressor in the game we got the sonic suppressor l and just like that we went over every single one shot sniper in warzone 3 right now one thing i really hope to see here soon is the xrk sniper able to one shot because honestly this thing is amazing definitely gives me some car 98 vibes but we'll see what call of duty's got in store for us if you guys enjoyed today's video make sure to go down below drop a big booty like and comment it means the world to me but more importantly guys i hope you have an amazing rest of your day and i'll catch y'all in the next one later guys